Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you are new to my channel, make sure you go ahead and click that subscribe button. If you are returning, welcome back. Everyone, make sure you click that notification bell so that you are not missing any of my videos that I post every single week. Today I am doing a video for those of you who are beginner roller skaters. If you are still wondering if a Moxie roller skate is a great beginner skate for you, this is the video for you to watch because I will be showing you guys some basic beginner roller skating moves on my Moxie jungle skates so if you'd like to learn some beginner roller skating moves keep on watching the first thing to know as a beginner roller skater is to bend your knees you guys you have to bend your knees when you're roller skating if you're bending your knees and if for some reason you fall which we've all fallen before it's happened it's going to happen get over it you're going to fall at least once so if you fall if your knees are bent at least you're already close to the ground see what i'm saying if you're skating upwards and not bending your knees you're going to lose your balance keep your knees bent it'll be a lot easier for you to glide yes so that's why it's super important to bend your knees. You wanna bend as much as possible because if you're up here and you fall, then you stumble. But if you're low, you're already close to the ground. Okay, so now that we've learned to bend our knees as much as possible, I'm gonna show you guys how to take off, all right? Now, being a beginner, you're going to tend to want to do this. Step, tap, step, tap, step, tap, step tap, step, tap. That's okay, but eventually you'll wanna smooth it out. So it's a right, a left, pick your feet up, but remember to keep your knees bent. A lot of people like to stay tall, pick it up. You're more likely to lose your balance. So keep those knees bent. If you're just learning to skate, it's okay to step, tap, step, tap. That's how I taught myself how to skate, eventually you'll smooth it out and pick one leg up at a time. Now I'm gonna show you guys some really cool warm-ups to get you ready to roll. Not only will this warm-up get you ready to roll, but this warm-up is also going to be an amazing workout for your legs and your booty. My most favorite warm-up are bubbles. Let me show you what those are. So you're basically, again, bending low. You're bringing your knees in and out, in, out, in, out, in, and out. This is a really great workout and warm up to get yourselves ready. And it also works the ankles too, if you're doing it correctly. You can do the same thing going out, in, out, in, out, in, out, in. And those are bubbles. Another good warm up that I like to do is simply stand in place and do some squats. The squats are going to help me to get my knees nice and warm because I will have to keep my knees bent the entire time. So doing squats repeatedly will have my knees ready to rock. Check it out. So here I like to have my legs super wide, not super close. I mean, you could if you wanted to because you're skating. Um, it's really your preference, but I like to just bend and stretch, bend, stretch. Don't lock out your knees though. Just bend and just raise your kneecaps. Bend, stretch. If you wanted to go close, you could. Just not too close, you guys, to where your wheels are touching. But here's good. So this is about hip widths apart. And just a bend and stretch. So check it out. Bend, stretch. You can even do some steps here because that'll help you to get comfortable on your skates. Try your best not to roll back, you guys. Always keep it planted, stay forward, because then you're closer to your toe stops if you do lose your balance, okay? Now maybe you add a little bit of movement to this. Bend, stretch, bend, stretch. Then you can add your bubbles. Bend, stretch, voila. Another cool warm up that I like to do is get my legs moving and flowing. So you can either do this sitting down or standing up, holding on to a wall or whatever is close to you. I like to just basically take the legs and bring them up and down. Okay, you can go here. This is if you don't wanna get more of an arm workout as well, but I personally like to lift up and lift my legs up here. 
So it's still kind of getting a nice little workout as well while you're warming up. So now you're like, Tiff, what if I fall? What happens when I fall? I'm so scared. Well, first of all, just so you guys know, I do highly, highly, highly recommend wearing protective gear. I have protective gear. However, I'm in my garage, so I feel pretty safe. Things could happen, but just know that I'm telling you guys to make sure you have protective gear, okay? So now you say, what if I fall, Tiff? That's what your toe stops are for. Your toe stops are your best friend. For me, I like to feel super safe, so I turn myself around to make sure that I'm definitely on my toe stops. See how I did that? So now I'm on my toe stops, still on my toe stops, and I'm back up, okay? So that's how I would get up if there was like a sidewalk or something that I could get close to. So now you're like, but Tiff, what if there's no sidewalk? and I've fallen, what do I do? Same concept, you guys. At least for me, the easiest way for me to get up again, use your hands, turn around, come up. See, I'm still on my toe stops. My knees are bent, they're not straight. Bend those knees, find your way back up, and still stay on your toe stop, you guys, just so that you can make sure that you have the proper balance. And that is how you get up if you fall on your skates. So now you are all warmed up and you are ready to have some fun on your roller skates. So let's quickly review what we have going on here. First, you've already done your warm up, right? Second, you know to bend your knees. Third, let's roll. I personally like to always start on my toe stop. I'm right handed, so I naturally want to start on my right foot with my toe stop down. When I'm ready to roll, I take off, pick up my left foot and pick my feet up and go. Still getting these bubbles in. I love bubbles, you guys. Little turn, coming back. So, now you've gotten the basics. Now you're feeling super comfortable. Now you say, Tip, I wanna have a little bit of fun on my skates. So, I'll show you guys how to do some basic, very basic turns. So when I take off and I'm ready to turn, I'm literally just turning my body. That's all I'm doing. Keeping the knees bent, okay? That also helps if you feel like you're about to lose your balance and fall. Really quickly turn your body, okay? It's with the leading shoulder. Bend the knees, swivel your body. Widen your legs. If you're here, you won't get much of a turn, okay? I'm not even gonna try it because I know I'll fall if I keep my legs too close. Keep those legs wide, all right? Next, I wanna show you guys how to do a pretty leg lift, okay? So you're probably saying, Tiff, I'm a beginner. I can't lift my leg up. So I will show you guys the easy way to start. I'll actually show you how I taught myself how to do it and then we'll progress, all right? So once you get some momentum going, you simply lift your leg. Even if it's just for a couple seconds. Work on your balance just by simply lifting the leg up for a second. Practice these in your warm up. Just lifting one leg at a time. Then hold it. Then hold it. Remember to stay forward, you guys. Don't lean back because then you'll, it'll be easier to fall. Lift, lower, lift, Lower, lift, lower. Next, you want to take that leg and bend it behind you. Watch. Lift it behind you. Remember to stay bent. I'm keeping my knees bent, but I'm going to lift that right leg. Boom. See? So now we've gotten that. Now we have to do is grab the skate. Here's what we're doing. You're grabbing the back wheel. Whichever one's more comfortable, the outside is more comfortable to me. Okay, let's do it. Now let's try it. Taking off, knees are bent, gaining some momentum, leaning forward, pick up the right leg, and boom. Again, bending, get a little more momentum, boom. Again, this is a beginner video, so I'm not going to go into 
super long holds or anything like that. I just want you guys to have something to where you can get started on your roller skating journey. So now we're going to put everything together and I'm even going to add a fake fall just so that you guys can see how I would get up if I fell. Okay, let's do this. Once again, thank you guys so much for checking out this video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Leave me a comment below if you love this video and if you want to see more skate videos like this. Until next time, be safe, stay healthy, and have fun. See you next time.